the Gasparilla Bowl. Monday, December 23rd, this is the Bad Boy Mowers, which is still one of my favorite bowl sponsors ever. You agree with this? Okay. You like them? You got a Bad Boy Mower? No, I don't have a Bad Boy. I don't have You a, know those things cost like $30,000. Yeah, they start at like 6 for the cheap end. Yeah. $6,000 like for a person. lawnmower. Mower costs like your car. <sighs> so this is on Monday. It's at 1.30 p.m. on ESPN in Tampa, Florida. Uh, Josh Heupel. UCF and Doc Holliday, Marshall, the Thundering Herd. Uh, UCF did not have a great year. No, but they lost to good teams. I don't know that I would call Tulsa a good team. I understand they lost. They lost some very close games, and they blew out everybody else. Right? I'm with you. Uh, UCF's offensive coordinator Jeff Lebby, hired by Lane Kiffin at Ole Miss. That's right. Um, Marshall. Head coach Doc Holliday is 6-0 and straight up and against the spread in bowl games. I don't think they've had to play anybody like UCF. I was just about to say. that It's a, it's a slightly fine. different thing there. Yes. Uh, UCF, 2-5 and five against the spread with two straight-up losses in their last seven as a 10-plus point favorite. That is not a good number. This season has not gone the way that they expected it to. Well, no. Um, I, look, my biggest thing about this game, right? That you can look at all these numbers. It, it, the line is 17 and a half. Um, the total is 61 and a half. You look at UCF, they're number nine in offensive yards per play. They're number seven in defensive yards per play. They're number six in offensive points per game. They're number 39 in defensive points per game. Uh, everywhere across the board, they are better than Marshall, right? Again, what bowl you end up in, Sometimes a motivation problem, right? Who you're playing against, sometimes a motivation problem. Marshall has 32 players on their 85-man roster from Florida. They are going to be fired up to be going home, to play in their home state, to play against UCF, a team that is favored over them by 17 and a half points. You know which way I'm leaning, don't you? I know. I'm taking the herd, man. Okay. Plus 17 and a half here. I'm going under the 61 and a half. Uh, I think that they are able to slow down that freshman quarterback. I think that Marshall finds a way. I don't think they're going to win the game necessarily. I think this is a lot closer than people think it's going to be. Everybody just assumes UCF is going to roll over them. Uh, when you don't want to be somewhere, it shows. And I think UCF does not want to be in this bowl game. It's only an hour away in Tampa. Like, they don't give a crap about this game. Marshall, however, does. And I think they are going to show up for this one. Uh, Marshall plus 17.5 and, and the under 61.5. Uh, I'm going to take UCF. They are better at every aspect of the game. They just are. You going over or under? <laughs> trying to think of what I think the score is going to be. I think it's still going to go under. Under? Okay, under 60. It's still going to go under. Okay. So you're you're expecting a blowout but yeah. But that way Marshall basically just doesn't score much. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I can, I can, I can see it. 17 to, you know, 30 ball game. 17 to 30 wouldn't score or wouldn't cover the 17 and a half. 17 to 35. Uh, thir- 38 to 17. That'd be 55. Gotcha. Yeah, they'd be under. Okay, I'm with you. I'm with you. 